Fun and welcome to the tour of the K Plus Agent Dashboard app. Now, the first thing you'll want to do is go into your Google Play or iTunes Store and download the Conversion Mobile app. It has this little white circle with the blue splash on it. And when you tap on this app, of course, it'll ask you to log in using the credentials of which you use to log into your normal desktop dashboard. And you'll see these four icons across the bottom. There is the dialer which is unique to the mobile app. There is the ability for you to look at all of your contacts within and search them by name. You can actually access your entire dashboard of which you would have access via your desktop. And there are these three little lines at the bottom right that have more goodies and we'll get to these in just a moment. Now let's go ahead and go back to that dialer tab at the bottom left hand side. Within, you can actually choose to call out to your current calls to make for the day here. You can actually click start. The system will give you a countdown. I'm going to go ahead and stop that countdown. And from here, you can see that you can either skip, you can tap on email to then email the person directly off of your, of your mobile device or text them via your mobile device. So this is a text connection via your own phone number, not via the app. And it's important to keep in mind that when you app phone to phone, we do not keep track of those conversations. Now within the dialer, you can choose your current calls to make, oldest people you want to get a hold of, actively searching new leads and so forth. You can even build dialer lists in with a specific hashtag. And it's important to take a look at how these hashtags are set up because when you're looking at the dialer by hashtag, you see how it's Clinton LP. This is a advertisement that I had put together for the area of Clinton and it was a landing page. So depending on where these folks landed in my statuses, they might be in sphere, new leads, active, etc. But make sure you're paying attention to the status of which that hashtag is corresponding. So if you know you put all those Clinton people in active, you're going to tap active and get that dialer going. All right, next one across the bottom is the contacts tab. Now this is where you can filter by contact name. So if you wanted to get hold of uh, Annalisa or Diego or someone, you know, you can actually search that out and it will bring up that information. You can tap on the phone to call them via your mobile device. You can text them via your mobile. And you can choose to email them via your mobile device. When you open up your Gmail, you have the ability, of course, to choose the Gmail of which it's coming from. So if you have more than one Gmail account, make sure you're choosing the correct one to send information. This is an exact mirror of what you're going to see on your desktop dashboard. The only difference is you have the dialer added on to the mobile app. So with your dashboard, if you want to access your settings, you're going to tap on the little arrow at the top right, and you can go into my settings. You can go in and look at your drip campaigns. You can go in and check out where your millions mapped link is and how you can send it, what your agent code is with millions mapped, your Zapier key. You can also tap on this other drop down arrow just to the left of your settings. This is where you have your quick actions of add lead, mass email, mass text, etc. Your notifications land just like they would on your desktop as well as if there's leads online, if you have any emails and your calls to complete for the day. Now to access your left hand panel of which you would normally see on your desktop, you can tap on these lines at the top right and that will give you your panel all the way into looking at your hashtag list, listings to search, lead gen tools, and so forth. Now, the last three dots on the bottom right-hand side will lead you to an additional open house link where you can actually drop in an MLS number here and create a sign-in form and hand that to people as they are signing in. Or you can have this on a locked iPad, on a stand, on a desktop, laptop, what have you. Now, if you have any questions anytime when you open up your app, you can actually see your dashboard. And similar to your desktop action, you can take a look here at the bottom right hand side and actually chat with a support rep right here.
Also, when you're on your mobile, you can actually access our support portal, which leads you to all of our to documents and written articles. Once you're here within the chat with support, you'll see all sorts of messages we may have sent you. And if you're wondering about how the system is operating, you can go to status and all systems operational is house reporting right now. Tap into that and see the health status of all of the products within our inside real estate family. I hope you have a great day and we'll talk with you soon. Bye-bye.